I'm Katie Tomczynska. I'm Lee Fork. And we had together to turn back to spring. Zoom three shot at two table. <laughs> Lee and I went to an academy called the British Academy of New Music and we were in separate projects from each other. We knew about each other's work but we weren't working together. I just decided to start working with Lee because I was really interested in what he was doing with film music. Let's have action and playback! Um, directing is basically making sure everyone understands my ideas and my visions um, and working in, in partnership with them so we come to a happy medium. Well, we started off um, in the Lee Valley, which is in Hackney Downs, and um, yeah, that was set beside the river. It was, it was kind of meant to be the wilderness shot, and um, it was an innocent style. It was basically my character before she became this seductress. It was, um, you know, the basis of wherever she went in the town afterwards. The character then comes into the city through the sort of uh, the neon lights of the streets. Um, the grubby alleyways, then into this kind of super sexy, seductive club um, where she sort of finds her prey. In this pub here, in the birdcage, we um, used the function room there and we dressed it um, for a bedroom scene and, and, and a bar scene, which is where we had all the extras. While the crew was, while the main crew was uh, filming in the valley, I ha we had to dress this, me and sort of people, my helpers, I had to dress this room and the bedroom and stuff like that. And that was quite difficult to run because we had time issues and stuff like that. You know, I wish I'd done do more stuff, but I think with what we got, it was really good for, you know, for what we could do. It really, I thought it turned out really nicely, so yeah, so that was the most rewarding part. Um, then it's sort of a boudoir scene where she would seduce them. I really liked the bedroom scene because it was a bit of a giggle. I, like I really liked that when the majestic bit when he was, yeah, Matt was on the um, tracking dolly and uh, the doors open. I quite liked the, the character, the acting, because obviously when we do gigs, then we just, it's the same thing, but I like to get in character. Uh, I'm the first AD, it entails running the shoot and coordinating with the director. Uh, to make sure that he can concentrate on what he wants to do, talking to the artists and getting the creative side of things right so that the show runs smoothly. We had the recce a couple of weeks ago, so we just had a look, talk about what shots we wanted and when and uh, how many extras we wanted to feed for lunch. So I um, worked it out on those bases. Yeah. I mean, me and Ben know each other quite well and most of the key members of the team all know each other, so we all appreciate the time pressures. I think it can be worse if the director hasn't got a clue about how long things take and wants everything, but Ben is quite reasonable, so. and Matt obviously as well. The graveyard is supposed to symbolise sort of the death of the devil in her um, and the guilt um, and the confusion and she's sort of running back off into the wilderness. When we were in the cemetery, I just had six inch lashes on and that's an exaggeration and on the bottom as well and lip gloss on my face to kind of depict tears and my, if, I just felt like my eyes were this small because I couldn't lift, physically lift my eyelids with it because the lashes were so heavy so I found that really difficult but I didn't want to complain because that's the look. There's different sides to her within this video and basically my role is to bring out the either the innocent side to her, like the angelic side or the devilish side so makeup can influence that a lot, it can really, you know, it can really bring out someone's personality. Today um, we've got to make Katie look quite broken, this is the first time in the video where she's actually showing a weakness, um, she's been quite a strong sort of person throughout the video so far you know seductress you know she's she's been quite strong but this this has really got to show that she's broken down it's going to be quite avant-garde makeup it's going to be really big you know really dark eyes she's going to be crying so <laughs> hopefully it'll be um yeah hopefully it'll work out <laughs>